Good evening and welcome back. So it's a top two clash between ourselves, Malaga and Real Madrid. We're currently two points ahead of them. Could we put some distance between us now? One bad bit of news is we, well, we had a 5-0 win the last match, which was great. No injuries in the game, but afterwards it turns out Martinelli picked up a bit of a knock. Now it's only a week out and the good news is, is that Mudrick is on a, an up anyway. So we probably would have started him. In terms of the team itself, we're going in with Schubert and goal. Normal back four apart from Teixeira is going to come in at left back. Got Alex Mariba, Lee Kang in, and Vieira in midfield. And like I say, Mudrick on the left, Diaby on the right, and Ruben Castro up top. Big clash today, and it's actually during the daytime. Good to see that for a change. I mean, that the last match, if you haven't seen it, please go watch it against uh, Cadiz, I think it was. We won 5 0, and it could have been more, just and some great goals as well. Giorbi man of the match. He was on fire in that game. Um, just one of those games where everything seemed to go right. And yeah, but it could have been like eight or nine. It could have been anything, really. Here's Emerson early on. Decent effort on target. You're not going to really chance the likes of Donnarumma uh, from that distance. Nice play there. Diaby. Plays in Ruben Castro. Ah, straight at the keeper again. But good pass and movement. We did rest Ruben Castro. Well, we brought him on as a sub for, you know, 20, 25 minutes. But um, Zirx, he actually started up top because he was on and up. And we brought Diori off to give him a rest specifically for this match. Nice tackle by Kosinu, but get a bit unlucky. A few deflections. And Real Madrid have got it back. Oh, come on. I'm not going to start, but it wasn't a free kick. Got the ball, came away with it. That's over. Od Odegaard actually back at uh, Real Madrid in this game. Obviously, plays for Arsenal. And he did earlier on in this Pez career mode. Here's Mudrick. Uh, couldn't get through there. Diaby though. Good tackle again. Head it now. DRB Mudrick, it's a really nice pass to Mudrick. I mean, you take that much of the player, is it really <laughs> not a free kick? I know he got the ball as well, but yeah, sometimes when you I'm not gonna start talking about it, but. Here's Castro. Diaby. Mudrick on the overlap there. And again, Mudrick. Wonderful team goal. What a finish as well. Just lots of one two passes, little triangle passes. Diaby, Mudrick to Castro. Back to Mudrick and slotted away. Had to be accurate with Donnarumma and goal. Yeah, right in the corner. I would deserve that. We really have. We've been certainly the better of the team. Creating more chances. Got to be very careful against Real Madrid, obviously. Got such good... Just the whole team is ah, uh, that was poor. Jobby was coming back the other way. It's not the way to pass it. But putting pressure on them, and we get it back. And here's Mudrick. Jobby, oh good save! What a turning shot that was, though. Very good goalkeeping. Lee Kang in. I haven't seen much of him yet. Jobby, whoo. -hoo. Quick turn, 
but good defending. It's really going to be a battle between, well, two powerhouses, really. Castro, good save. How did he get through there? That was poor defending that time. Good goalkeeping. Nice ball in. Joby's not the tallest though. Oh, great tackle there. Castro will try to play over the top. Now Diaby. Deflects. Keep should have that. He does. I thought that was going to go to Diaby there. Lovely tackle from Cosano. Maybe a chance for a counter. And again, it looked like Castro had the ball, but then he didn't. Just clearing it there, not taking any risks. Can't do that against Real Madrid. Got a corner to defend. Castro hasn't really got any support. Didn't manage to hold it up though. So he could keep it for a couple of seconds. Good. Well, I was going to say good tackle, but somehow they get the pass away. Diaby again. Guys, this end end stuff. Now Vieira. Oh, goalkeeper saved it, I think. No. I'm sure he saved it. That should be half time. We'll jump straight in the second half. Real Madrid had slightly the better of possession, but all of the chances were ourselves. But again, got to be very careful because strength of this team they could create just one decent chance and score it that's what you've got to be wary of you've got to be switched on the whole time in, in defence Diaby now Lee Kang in Castro Diaby nicely played through Emerson but he does not react at all pressured well though now Lee Kang in what can he do for me yet? Lee Kang in. Oh, Tonoroma just kept that out. Be another corner. Oh, just wide. Should have scored there. Kang in Lee. Let's hope we don't live to regret some of these chances that we just haven't quite taken. Wouldn't say we've missed any sitters or anything, but... Oh, Castro gets lucky. Don't really know what's going on. <laughs> Madrid hits off our own player. Diaby. Vieira. Can't get it through to Diaby. It's deflecting everywhere. What the hell is going on here? It's chaos. Diaby gets taken out, but got the ball as well. Good tackle from Teixeira. Oh. These referees. Ice. Wait, I'm going to stop talking. Perfect tackle. 
what's more annoying is the fact that we're on a counter attack there. TRB. Oh, nice little play there. Can we get in? No. Nice tackle from Diaby there. And we'll get the throw in. Let's see if we can make some subs. Okay, so change wise, we're going to bring on Carlos Perez up top for Ruben Castro. Lee Kang in going off for Gedson. And we're going to bring on Shirkoff in the right back position. Not his favourite position, but uh, Debussy's on a bit of a down. Yeah, just Ruben Castro and Lee Kang in. They've put in a shift and they're looking a bit tired. Need those fresh legs. Didn't really want to take them off, but. Very nice ball to Gedson. Oh, Mudrick. Gedson again. Blocked twice there. Referee, seriously. Are you not out to even try and tackle? Oh, God forbid you try and tackle Benzema. It's a free kick automatically. I'm sick of these bloody decisions. Is that going to be a free kick as well? No, okay. Vieira. Sorry, I'm going around right there. Uh, DRB. Ah. Uh, just wasn't enough support. Too many black shirts. Nice play by Mudrick. And what's going on here? Vieira. How did he not get the shot away? Oh, good save. Strong hand from Schubert there. Carlos Perez. Now, he has played up top a few times earlier on in our career mode. And he normally does well. And we've actually got a free kick this time. Kind of needed that just for things to settle down. Madrid pass behind Takshara. Mariba. Oh, Madrid. There's no room for manoeuvre in there. The ball clears up there. Now Zirkov. Nice play there. Mudrick with a little bit of space. And he plays a wonderful ball through to Perez. 2-0. And the substitution has worked. Perez out wide to Mudrick. And there's just a bit of a gap there to run into. Beautiful ball. First time finish past Donnarumma. Lovely pass from the outside of the foot there. What a class act Perez is. God, it's been some effort though. It's been a really hard fought game. Very close, as you'd expect, you know, it's a top two clash. Tackle by Teixeira there. Now Mudrick. He has had a good game. Gets in. Perez. Diaby. Oh, gets foul. Perez. Yep. And it's a free kick. I'm glad the referee pulled it back there. Because Diaby got taken out just as he was uh, passing. Um. No, Vieira's got to be the free kick taker here. Oh, it hits the wall. We have been getting better. It's another free kick. Okay. Diaby getting fouled again in the air. Don't often see aerial challenges go for uh, free kicks, but again, maybe we'll try Mudrick. Let's try Mudrick. Oh, hang on, let's try. Yeah. Straight the keeper again. Gets in. Now Marie bet. Diaby. 
Oh, what a curling finish. That's got to finish off the game now. And this just shows you how good Diaby is. Basically, creating a chance out of nothing. Little touch and just doesn't even hesitate. This will be a nice angle. Keeper didn't stand a chance. Oh, I've changed it. Right in the corner. You know, just a few minutes ago, it was still only 1-0. There was always that threat that they could go on a counter-attack and score or just... You know, Benzema can score out of nothing. And all of a sudden it's three. It'd be great to keep that clean sheet if we could. <sighs> Why did I say that? And I'm so scared of tackling Benzema because every time he seems to touch him, the referee blows the whistle. Very good finish from him, though. Disappointed. Yeah. He's a class act Benzema, isn't he? So it is a good job we got a bit of a cushion. Like I say, he can pretty much score out of... I mean, that wasn't nothing, but he had it all to do. Here's Perez. Through to Mudruk again. Mudruk. And Teixeira. Gedson. Mudrik. Diaby. No. Good tackle. Mudrik. Perez. Mudrik's got no... Nothing left in his legs, I don't think. That could be full time. And it is. What a win. And we're now five points clear in the league. Stats wise, tells it all really, possession pretty much equal, but 16 shots, 18 on target, they had 3 with 2 being on target, and they still scored the 1, Schubert made 1 decent save, and that finish from Benzema was class at the end, but by that stage it didn't really matter, it was 3-0 up at the time, with only a couple of minutes left. And Mudrick getting man of the match, I wouldn't disagree, I, I said during that game that for that assist where he set up Perez, he was brilliant all game. Diaby obviously very good, Castro brilliant when he was on the pitch, just brilliant all round performance, and the subs especially Carlos Perez, did very well. And as you can see, we're now nine wins out of nine, but more importantly, five points clear of Real Madrid with that six-pointer against them. Barcelona, because of that, have now closed the gap a little bit to them. Got a bit of a cushion for ourselves. And the big games keep on coming. We're at home to Anderlecht in the Champions League next. Remember that we're joint top of that group of AC Milan. We've got a little bit of a gap now down to Anderlecht, but I think if we win that one, we're pretty much guaranteed for a top two finish which would be brilliant to get through to the knockout stages. On our first chance at the Champions League, can we replicate another European trophy? We won the, the Europa League in the last season, remember. Can we win the Champions League this season? It's a big ask. Join me for that one. Hit that like button, drop a comment down below, and subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Thanks for joining again, and I'll see you all soon. Cheers.